My inspiration for Aunt Greatness comes from a real life person, my Aunt Dorrit, who would take me in when my uh, mother had had enough of me, which means most weekends <laughs> I was there. <laughs> and in her company, I always felt loved and safe and useful. And she reminded me of uh, the character Auntie Mame of stage, film, and book it, with her hospitality and great big laughs and how it was always the right time for cupcakes. <laughs> and you know, Auntie Mame was based on a real character, a New Yorker named Marion Tanner. And uh, she was described in the language of the day as zany and madcap. <laughs> she lived in Greenwich Village and divorced her first husband at age 27. <laughs> she adopted her orphaned nephew and moved him into her great big house at number 52 Bank Street, which she had filled to the rafters with her bohemian friends, the sculptors and writers and singers. And she lived to age 96 and died in 1985. And the minister at her memorial service said, in her presence, ordinary things seemed to sparkle. And she insisted that we live our lives in capital letters. Light the candles. Get the ice out. Roll the rug up. It's today. Though it may not be anyone's birthday. And though it's far from the first of the year. I know this very minute has history in it. We're here. There's a time. Making merry, and so I'm for making hay. 